Hey, Karen, I'm just going to show you what I mean, because um, it doesn't make sense, does it? So, uh, Katie put in that uh, she debugged the main URL, but the actual picture when it was shared just she showed her face still, right? So what what happens is if you go, I go to is it Katie's thing? This is this is if you look at the top here, you you see it says uh, the URL of the course so you are then going to go to facebook debugger um oh facebook debugger and put in that url and then um debug it and you may have to do it a few times for it to take for it to take a new picture on the new one but what happens is when you so you do that one, but then you click share and then the image is different because if you go up to the top here and if you grab it all, Facebook debugger won't like it, but if you grab it all, you'll see um, that the actual URL, if I get rid of that bit, has got a course number at the end of it. It isn't the same URL as the one before. So the one before is... is um, Pay, it's a page basically it's a sales page but yet the the uh, share button sh shares the course number so you have to debug that as well uh, even though even though one points to the other if you go to this page I think I think it bounces it on yeah so it bounces it on but for some reason it may not be happy um, in that share. Uh, it may just be that we did it too early. Once they debugged it a few times, it worked. But it's just a weird little thing that you need to be aware of is that when you, like the Twitter ones makes it more obvious, doesn't it? So if you click the, sh the Twitter button, the URL, that URL there is different to that URL up there. So it must be something that it does. Um, it's probably something to do with the coupon codes and, and changing the main sale page on the coupon and something like that. But yeah, it's that um, it's that URL there that you want to make sure you debug as well. So it may it may have been a case where it would have taken if you just debugged it enough times anyway. But for some reason, and Teachable will be able to tell us eventually, I guess, that those two URLs are different. Hope that makes sense. Any more questions, let me know. Cheers.